Hi, this is Virgo the Oracle, and I'm here to do a reading for the sign of Virgo. Hey, Virgo, how are you? Welcome back. Let's tap into this energy like we always do. See if it changed, see if it stayed the same. Spirit come through for Virgo, sun, moon, and rising. Your stone was jade. Everything it touches is blessings, okay? All right, everything it touches, my love. Everything jade touches, it blesses. Come through, spirit. Mm -hmm. What messages do you have for Virgo, sun, moon, and rising? All right, Virgo, what's going on with Virgo? Sun, moon, and rising. Spirit, come through for Virgo. Mm -hmm. Come through for Virgo, sun, moon, and rising. All right, mm hmm. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. I would love to have you. Mm -hmm. First position you have. Wait a minute. Let's ring the bell. Hold your ears. Spirit, come through. We need you. Mm -hmm. First position is the Ace of Swords. Okay. Mm -hmm. Second is the World. Mm. What's this? The King of Pentacles. Okay. Got powder eggshell over me. Okay, you have the Nine of Cups, all right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You have the Queen of Swords, all right, okay. You got the Star card. Yeah, 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 okay. Come through, Spirit. Virgo, Someone in Rising. We have the Lovers. Mm-hmm. You got the Two of Swords. Mm-hmm. We have the justice, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You have the moon, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We have the ten of swords, all right? Okay. Mm-hmm. And we have the queen of wands, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, then. Hold tight. Change is coming. Spirit, come through. <sighs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Virgos, you have one, two, three, four, five major arcanas. We will certainly take them, okay? And at the bottom of the deck. <clears throat> High Priestess Energy, very intuitive energy. Yeah, many of you are light workers, very intuitive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Harnessing your own powers now. You're getting really strong in your in your intuition too. You're just like you're running to it instead of running from it. Okay, you're embracing who you are and what you are, and you, you're liking it. You're wanting more of it. Oh, I love it. Ooh, so you don't, you're intuitive. You know this person loves you. Whoever this person is that's in your life. King of Cups. You got somebody that's very much in love with you, very emotional over you. They try to play hard to get. They try to act like they're not all twisted over you, but they are. Okay, this is somebody who tries to reserve, keep, stay reserved and keep their feelings to themselves, their emotions to themselves. However, this person is very emotional over you. It could be a, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, or was just in their chart. But you got somebody who, and you know it too, intuitive energy. You you all know it. You know this person loves you. You know just how much this person and loves you you're gonna have a decision to make too because uh as much as you know this person loves you you second guess something mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you're not sure about something right rather you want a relationship with this person or you want to go back to this person or you want to take this person back you're just not sure okay but you intuitively, intuitively know that this is that you're all this person thinks about yeah the decision is going to be yours okay you got some good news coming in uh -huh. this person wants a new beginning with you mm -hmm. they want to travel they want to take you out it's like some sort of new creative energy that's going to spark this relationship with this person yeah this person is losing control of er of everything this is a person that's not in control if they with somebody else this, this somebody else is ruling them or bossing them or controlling them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This person needs to take back their power. Very weak, okay? This person is not in their full strength right now. This person is feeling lost. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody's fully controlling this person. This person might be under witchcraft, some sort of uh, spell work or something, okay? Because this person is coming up in reverse, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They're emperor in reverse. That's somebody who's not in control of nothing, okay? Somebody's totally manipulating them, lying to them, trickery. You name it, there it is. Okay, let's see what else we got. Mm -hmm, spirit come through. 
The person is desperate to talk to you, whoever this person is. We got the Eight of Swords. Okay, whoever your connection is, whoever this is coming through or resonate um, with you uh, with, this person is dying to talk to you. Mm -hmm. You got the Ace of Swords. Yeah, this person wants some sort of heart-to-heart uh, -heart conversation with you. You got communication coming in. This person just don't know the words to say. Okay, when they see you, they get butterflies. They get scared. They get nervous. They start dropping shit, get all confused and stuff like that. You can sense it. You, you're definitely high priestess energy. You toy with this person's emotions a lot. You play with them a lot because you know. You know how much this person wants you. You know how much this person likes you. They just don't know how to say it, but you want to hear it. You want to make them do monkey flips in the street to prove it to you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But you got a whole new world coming in. Not to worry. A whole new beginning. Mm -hmm. A whole new realization. Okay, you, This is like the ending. This is an ending. You have been full circle with this person. Full circle. Y'all done been through this, that, this, that, that, and the other thing. Okay, So now you're coming full circle. Okay, This person does want some sort of justice with you where they think they owe you an apology okay you got some sort of uh victory coming here okay mm -hmm. this is first position this is communication that's haul assing in it's coming in ready ready whether you want it to or not and it's coming in from a king of pentacles energy this is somebody who's boss like energy um uh, financially lucrative wealth okay this person does very good for themselves it could be an older gentleman mm -hmm, mm -hmm. if they're not older they're very like wise for their own age for the age or something like that old soul been here before however you look at it think more about their finances than they think about anything else money 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 is on their mind if am i making enough how much did i make do i need more it's constantly what they what they uh think about is their finances okay but all of a sudden they also thinking about you this person wants to talk to you they think the world of you mm -hmm. you brought something else to their life something that they've been missing for a long time and they didn't realize they was missing it until they met you okay this person might have mistreated you too they might have not not directly mistreated you they just didn't know how to accept you they didn't know how to figure you out they didn't know how to figure you into their life you was something cut from a different cloth you was something forbidden or something uh that they were afraid to touch or or, or wasn't supposed to have or something like some sort of forbidden, forbidden brute fruit i'm feeling like this person feels that they shouldn't be with you or they shouldn't be trying to uh, get with you maybe you're married maybe they're married they just feel like they shouldn't do it but they want it so bad mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah you got the nine yeah nine of cups you're their wish fulfillment mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you're their wish fulfillment mm -hmm. this person is very uh this person is it's like very, uh, they view you very positively, okay? Like they view you like good news or something like that. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, it's something about your energy that that gives them medicine or heals them or helps them or gives them some sort of reassurance, okay? If this person is out of control now and don't know where the hell they're going, if they're out of control now and don't know where they're going and don't know what they're doing and, you know, lost right now, don't know how to pull themselves together, it's because you're not in their life, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, you have been very cold to this person, even though you're their wish fulfillment. You've been very cold, distant. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You want truth. You want blunt truth. No nonsense truth. you standing strong on it, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're very mature, very sophisticated. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It says also you're a problem solver. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this person is missing the fact that you that you can solve all of their problems. Whenever they're confused about something, whenever they're baffled about something, whenever something come up in their life and they just need somebody to discuss it with. You know, they normally ran to you or would talk to you, but you have cut them off. You've been standing very guarded. Okay, this is the divorce ladies card. This is somebody who's focusing on themselves. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. But you're very honest, you're very candid energy, and you want candid energy in return. You want some truth. You want you be blunt because you're very blunt. You sh everything come out your mouth, come to your head is out your mouth. You speak truth. You shoot. You shoot straight from the hip. Okay, you don't dance around nothing. Okay, and you want that in return. Okay, you're getting a lot of attention too, Virgo. All of a sudden, mm -hmm. you're getting a lot of attention. Mm, look at that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And, and your your your. This spiritual journey that you're on is definitely heightening, okay? It's lifting you higher, okay? You may be cutting a lot of people out of your life, okay? You have moved on. Uh huh. Everybody can't go with you, and you realize that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. There's a very good opportunity that's coming your way soon. It's going to bring in a lot of attention for you, okay? A lot of victories for you, mm hmm. A lot of recognition for you. This is wish fulfillment. This is what you've been praying for. This is what you've been wishing for, no matter what it is, okay? You're going to do very well. This person loves you. 
loves you very much. You love them too. I don't want to hear it. You love them too. You got the lovers card. Okay, there's two people loving. Okay, you love each other very much. Okay. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah. You. It looks like you guys want a commitment with one another. Y'all want this to go a little bit further. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm we got romance, soulmates, compatibility, sexual connection, romance, passion, and love. Y'all want more. Point blank, period. You two want more with each other, okay? All right, but it's some stipulations here. You got to stop doing this. You got to leave that person alone. You got to come over here more. You got to call me more. It's some stipulations here, okay? This is why you're so distant. This is why you're so cut off. This person is dropping a ball somewhere, okay? They're not meeting all your expectations or all your aspirations or something. They're not meeting at all, okay? This is why you're cutting them too short to shit. You may have cut this person out your life. You might not have too much to say to this person. This is very guarded energy, two of them, queen of swords and two of swords, okay? You might be very acting. You may be acting very cold or distant towards this person, and they can't take it. This is why this person is feeling like they're losing their goddamn mind. Mm-hmm. This is why they're in the, the emperor in reverse energy. Because you have cut them out or cut them off. Lord have mercy. What you do to them, Virgo? Virgos, y'all need to cut it out sometimes. You know y'all can be too tough. Too, too tough. Y'all, ooh, remember that song, Too Tough? Mm -hmm. Well, it was a rap song, but that was my jam. <laughs> I cracked myself up. So damn tough. That was my shit. <laughs> Well, anyway, y'all so damn tough. Look, now, cut it out. All right, you done cut this person out. You know this person. Love it. You love them. People be trying to come and talk to you. You don't want anyone to talk to them. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because you know you got this person in, your, in the back of your mind, okay? You got a lot of pursuiters. You're getting a lot of attention, Virgo. Ooh. Uh-huh. You guys are looking good. Mm-hmm. You're in shape. You're dressing nice. Uh-huh. Your energy feels really good. This person has something to come tell you, too. Mm. Truth is coming out. We have the uh, justice card here. Mm -hmm. Some truth and some order. This person might have legal trouble, legal matters. Okay, they might have to go to court. They might be in court. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a secret. They're not telling you. Okay, they're in a lot of pain too. Your person is with somebody else that they're miserable with. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, they're in a very bitter divorce or a very bitter. Uh, um, relationship that's in, that's on the brink of ending. Mm -hmm. We have failure, enemies. Either they are or you are. Okay, this is enemies. They don't even get along. These people don't even. If they're in the same house or if they living together, one sleep on the couch and one sleep in the bedroom. Yeah, we got victim consciousness. We got spiritual attack. This person might be doing voodoo on this person. Mm -hmm. Totally blocking everything. They might not. They might not have any uh, good luck right now. Everything they touch is turning into shit. Ooh, honey, the queen of wands in reverse. I I ain't even see that lord 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 hmm. even if you are a uh, even if you are a male here and your person is with somebody else they with a low down dirty dirty who's trying to destroy them okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this is just a really low vibrational energy dirty dirty as hell don't want no success for your person none Okay, this is all for self. Okay, if they are in a relationship or they're in a marriage, this person got into this relationship with your person for the wrong reasons. Possibly for the money. Possibly for the accolades. Possibly for whatever this person was doing for them. Okay, it was never for love. This is a very selfish, self-centered person. Okay, they like eye candy. Your man or your woman may look really good. Okay, they may fit that bill looking really good or something. This person never wanted them for love. It's, it's for whatever they can do for them, whatever they was doing for them, whatever they had to offer them okay mm, look at that it was never love okay however you look at it this person is miserable as fuck with them but they can't get away from it. they don't know how they may have to get a divorce first or something like that however you're looking at it they're keeping this a secret this is their this is their insecurities this is their doubt this is their embarrassment this is their humiliation uh this is all the fuck shit that's wrong with them you know you wonder why don't they come tell me nothing why don't they talk why don't they let me know what's going on it's embarrassing too Mm -hmm. It's embarrassing too. They feel like they've been bamboozled, tripped, lied, tricked, lied to, played a fucking fool. Whether you're here for a male or female, somebody's feeling very insecure. Somebody's feeling very like a very much like a first class ass because they clearly see now that they have been played. Okay, because they're miserable as fuck. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Miserable as fuck. Very got a victim uh, mentality, victim consciousness. Like 
You know, they did this to me, they do that to me, and this happened, and that, and I was good to them, and I did that, and they did this, and they, I mean, just bitching and crying like a little boy or girl, whoever it is, okay? Just crying. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Yeah, they realize they're in a dead end relationship with this person, okay? Mm hmm. They may have tried to hold on to it for whatever reason, okay? And left you by yourself, and you said, okay, good, I'm gonna I'm stay by myself. If you can't appreciate my presence, I'm gonna I'm let you appreciate my absence, and you cut them off, you cut them out of your life, okay? And now you're getting all this attention from other people. You're out um, on the limelight. You're going to the beach. Shit, you're doing you. Mm -hmm. you living life, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Knowing how much this person loves you, you done cut, cut them off. Mm -hmm. Now you're about to get their truth. Now everything that they was trying desperately to hide from you is about to come out, okay? This person just didn't want you to know this, Virgo. They didn't want you to know... Uh, that they were miserable in their situation, that they're stuck in a situation that, that they can't get out of or they can't wait to get out of or some fuck shit like that. This person is very unhappy. M they may even resent you because you're happy. You're not going through none of this fuck shit that they're going through. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This person might be really worried. Where are you? and uh, How are you doing? Are you, ha are you happy? I see that you got the whole world in your hand. Mm -hmm. So they might be a little like, a little under underlined jealous that you're not going through this misery or that they chose wrong. This person makes some very bad decisions, okay? They have made some very bad decisions, uh -huh. all for the wrong things. They might have fell for this person for looks, uh, for sex, um, you know, for stroking their ego. What this person could have, you know, when uh, did the oral sex to them better than what they ever had in their life or some fuck shit? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't quite understand the uh, attraction here because this person really don't like this person. But at one time, maybe this person did some sort of magic on them or something like that. Maybe this person licked their every hole on their damn body or some fuck shit, turned them out, you know, gave them some, gave them a, a piece of a freak they have never had before. However you look at it, this person is really feeling like a first class ass. They feel tricked. They feel bamboozled. They feel, they feel played. Okay. Mm -hmm. And, and, and instead of, uh, giving the onlookers, um, the chance to say, I told you so, they, they sticking in it. They sticking in it, even though they know they miserable as fuck. And if they don't get out of it, it's going to start affecting their health. Uh huh. Their thinking and their money. Okay. Let's pull some clarifiers and see what else we can get. Spirit, come through. Okay. I guess he want me to use these. Spirit come through for Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Wow, Virgo. Mm -hmm. You're trying to run from this person, Virgo. You're going to run right into this person. <laughs> you, you can't avoid this person like that. Y'all got something that's, uh, that's kind of like written in the stars. It's inevitable. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. This person has to get his karma though. He's got a. He's going through. He or she is going through a great deal of it too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have believe and succeed. Mm -hmm. Some of you have, may have a birthday, September the sixth. If you do, happy birthday. But Spirit wants you to believe and succeed, okay? It's something that you guys have to believe in order to succeed. Especially if you had a birthday, September the 6th, okay? You know it's something that, you, that you're supposed to do um, or you should be, or something important that you, should, that you need to do, okay? But you don't believe that you can or something like that. You have lost all hope. You're doom and gloom. Mm -mm. Change that belief, honey, and you will succeed no matter what it is, all right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, you're not reaching out for help. Some of you need to reach out for help help we got reach out in reverse okay you may have a birthday on september the third okay some of you guys need to reach out mm -hmm. maybe reach out for help maybe reach out to this person okay mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. yeah yeah you waiting mm -hmm. y'all waiting for this person to reach out to you stubborn energy your person is just as stubborn as you. Your person is waiting for you to reach out and you waiting for them to reach out. Because mm -hmm. you're not doing it. You say, shit, I ain't reaching the hell out. I'm waiting for you. You waiting for me? Good. Because I'm waiting for you. And both of you guys love each other very much. Again, you could have a birthday September the 6th. You could have a birthday September the 2nd. September the 3rd. September the 6th. Look at that. Especially September the 6th. Y'all better pay attention, honey. 
Spirit got a message for you today. Mm, 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 mm. And if you got a birthday September the 19th, honey, you are shining. You are shining and you are glowing. You got a birthday coming up. Happy birthday to you, baby. Happy birthday to all my Virgos. I forgot. Happy birthday to, to every last one. Those who already had one, those who's having one today, and those is, is, is coming. Happy birthday, my loves. Yeah, some of you guys got to teach this person a le lesson, or you are teaching this person a lesson, especially if you the, the September the 5th. But September the 19th is doing her thing. His or her thing, honey. Y'all shining. Y'all taking off. Y'all y'all literally floating right now. You're not even walking. You're in a very good place. Uh huh. Joy, happiness, wish fulfillment, some sort of enlightenment that you're going through, some sort of awakening. You, this is the best that you have felt in a very long time possibly because you have been releasing some shit you have been releasing a lot of shit here we got release okay some of you could have a birthday september the 13th okay happy birthday to you as well yeah it's time for you to embrace something though something that you've been avoiding you have to embrace it okay mm -hmm. embrace where spirit is taking you embrace embrace this new life embrace this new love embrace this new awakening okay it's some sort of new you that's coming in for you okay it's time to embrace it september the 21st could be your birthday mm -hmm. yeah it's something that you worked on or that you have working on you've been praying on here it come oh yeah i can't make this shit up it's blossoming my love you could have a birthday september the 20th as well mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's, it's blossoming you got some sort of new fight vitality look at this okay some of you are in the same sex relationship too okay if you are this is definitely resonating with you you could have a birthday september the first okay if you got a birth birthday september the first mm, this new vitality is going to bring in so much abundance so much love so much self-insurance okay a whole new energy is about to like um catapult you to a whole new different level okay you're going to have more clarity better understanding you won't get upset so much okay yeah, yeah spirit is just like literally riding with you okay especially if you september the first okay you're going to be doing some healing okay this is new vitality this is like taking off this this is like releasing this old ass energy and stepping into a new okay this literally may be what you have done or that you what you will do especially if you guys hold september the first okay spirit come through what else we got absolutely beautiful absolutely beautiful let's see what else we got for virgo come through virgo come through for virgo spirit come through come through for virgo uh -huh. spirit come through for virgo what else do we have for virgo sun moon and rising Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Strength. You guys are so strong. You're stronger than what people know. Mm -hmm. But you look so delicate. Mm -hmm. You look so easygoing. You look you look like a total pushover. But they don't know that you are a whole beast inside. <laughs> they don't know that you are not to be fucked with. But they always got to find out the hard way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This may have been a beautiful summer for you, Virgo. Positive changes are coming or have come. Mm -hmm. Freedom, joy, good time, warmth. Do what makes you happy, all right? Mm -hmm. Some of you are, are overthinking too much too, Virgo. If you're overthinking on a negative, change that toxic thinking, okay? Stop thinking doom and gloom that everybody's out to get you or everybody's is, is something. if something goes wrong, somebody's attacking me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't give nobody that kind of power, okay? Naturally, I do tell you to stay on your guard. You know when shit ain't right. Always protect yourself. Okay, but I, I don't want you to be scared. I don't want you to be fearful, you know. Uh -huh. I don't want you to be afraid, okay, just because somebody's trying to attack you or somebody's negative, throwing evil. I fuck them all the way live, just the hell with them. Never give them that much power. Just know what you got to do for you, but don't give them no power, okay. Don't give them no power. Your Empress energy. I don't give a fuck what they throw in. It can never touch you. Your Empress energy, okay? You can't bless. You can't curse, but God has blessed. You just can't. You cannot do it. And now, I, I swear on everything. You guys know this, okay? You know they can't touch you, but yes, they're going to keep trying to throw. They're going to keep trying to hate. They're going to keep trying to hinder. They're going to keep trying to block. What I want you to do is don't get fearful. Don't get scared because that only gives them energy. That gives them power that, that to make it work. But when you stand strong and you fight back with everything that's in you, because the fight starts within you. The fight literally starts when, within you. Okay, yes, we have the candles. We have the spiritual baths. We have the crystals. We we have all you name it i got it okay but the but the true energy comes from what i put in it okay it comes from within you all right mm -hmm. all your other tools yeah 
they're there for you to utilize. But the true power come from within. Don't give them your power. Don't give them that fear. Uh huh. You look at them right. There. You look at them as clear as your eyes can see, and you say, "I see you, and I see what you're up to." You want to play with me? Okay, we can play. I participate. And then when you whip their ass, they're gonna be staggered. Nowhere to go. Can't nothing going right with them. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah. Stalled energy. Everything they put, everything they're going through at you is gonna be stalled. Okay. Everything. As soon as you put your work in, now let them put their work in. All right. You go ahead and you can throw your little shit. Okay, my spirit guy's gonna wake me up in the middle of the night and tell me exactly who's doing it. Now, when I fight back, be prepared, be ready. Okay, that's what you tell them. Be prepared. Mm -hmm. Baby, let me tell you, you star energy. There's a whole dream team that walks behind you. Mm -hmm. A whole dream team, and some of them is not as nice as you are. Okay, some of them ride out, especially your ancestors. They ride out, they, they don't like foolishness in no way. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You got the moon card here. Mm-hmm. Secrets, anxiety, fear. You can't fear. This is what I'm uh, this is what I'm picking up. Y'all can't be afraid, uh, okay, to do well or be afraid to succeed because somebody gonna get jealous and start hurting you. If you you could be struggling, the motherfucker throw at you. You know that. You can be struggling, need a job, need money. People still go at you. If you're in a good energy, don't don't panic thinking, you know, okay, I'm on. I'm going to start panicking because I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop. The other shoe ain't going to drop. You're going to keep moving. You're going to keep grinding. You're going to keep doing well. We have the temperance energy here, okay? Somebody's definitely trying to come back, okay? Somebody was mad that you closed the door on them. We have closing time. Stop, block, of over, avoid. Plans will go unfulfilled. Yeah, somebody wants back in with you, Virgo. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Somebody wants back in with them with you bad. They just got too much pride and ego to come let you know. Okay. They want to reach out, but when they do reach out, they talk about everything but what they really want to say. Okay. Mm -hmm. You got the middle of the month. You're going to hear from this person mm -hmm. in the middle of the month. Opposite of what is expected. Jealousy, hidden, seduced, sexuality. Something will be renewed. Okay. This person is going to show you that they're jealous of you. This person is going to get mad. They're going to see something. Uh huh. They may see you going out on a date. They may see a date coming to your house. They may see you with someone else in the middle of the month okay yeah it's going to be the opposite of what you expect you expected them to you know ignore you you, ex you might expect them to act like they don't see you or not respond oh they're going to respond this person is going to act like a first class ass mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah because they think you're moving on this person thinks you're moving on this is their biggest fear okay this is their biggest fear that they that you're moving on from them and your biggest fear is that somebody is going to do something to you Mm -mm, no, ain't nobody going to do shit to you. This is why you come to this channel, so you can learn how to protect yourself. You have been protecting yourself. You're doing fine. Change that stinking thinking. Change that wayward thinking, okay? Don't give them no power. Don't give these kitchen witches no damn power. They don't know what the fuck they doing. They ain't doing it but cursing themselves. And then they're going to come to you. <laughs> or then they're going to come to me and ask for a damn spiritual bath. <laughs> Spirit come through. We got the world card here. Whole new energy is coming in for you. Okay. You guys got to clean your energy because this is a new coming in for you. Okay. If you're around stagnant people or stagnant energy, don't take that with you. Okay. Because a whole new world is coming to you. This is completion. You have already been, you already completed this task. This journey is completed. Okay. Uh huh. And, and many of you, Virgos, what the fuck? This is your birthday season. Why is your vibration so low? I'm working really hard here trying to lift it. I'm working very hard trying to lift your energy. It's, it's like like y'all don't believe that success is coming. Y'all don't believe that good is here. Y'all don't believe that you're going to do well. What the fuck? Mm. Lift up your energy. Lift up your energy. Okay, yeah, some of you going through some sort of tower. Something has hit. Some of y'all are depressed and your heart is heavy. Oh, Lord. Spirit, please give me some energy to tap into, but this one, yeah, you guys know damn well that this love here with you and this person is not over. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think this is what's keeping you down and balled up in fetal position, feeling some type of way. Some Somebody's crying a little too much. It could be their birthday they crying. Their birthday could literally be today, and somebody's just not fulfilled. They're just not happy because the right person is not around. Ay, 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 ay. All I can say to that is fill it and move through it because ain't nobody got time. 
Okay? You're giving up too much of your energy. Pull it back. All right? It might not even be yours. It might be the person that you're thinking about. Okay? They might be crying and you're feeling it. Tell that f person I was about to cuss. <laughs> Tell them, uh-uh, don't send that over here. Take it back. Okay? I'm not going there with you today. And take it and send it back. You pull yourself out of that hole, out of that doom and gloom, all that out of that woes me energy. Mm -mm. Y'all got to lift it, lift it. Do whatever you got to do to lift it. Put your music on. Go get your glass of wine. Go outside. Get dressed. Sometimes when you get shopping and dressed and get pretty and just go be seen, it makes you feel a little bit better. Go some damn way. Mm -hmm. Get out of that energy. I hope you enjoyed my read. I certainly enjoyed bringing it to you. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Talk to you soon. I share.